The mayor of Minneapolis and the police chief both say it was time to take back the 4th precinct. They spoke this morning after police moved in to move protesters out. Ashley Roberts was there and she continues our team coverage now from the newsroom. Ashley. Ali, Mayor Betsy Hodges and Police Chief Janae Harto say the past 18 days have been a challenge for residents as well as officers at the 4th Precinct. Chief Harto says overtime costs for the police department have reached $750,000. From the beginning, protesters made it clear they wouldn't leave voluntarily. Chief Harto says city officials formed a plan they believe would be safe for everyone involved in order to remove the occupation. Both Harto and Hodges tell us they support First Amendment rights and freedom of speech, but not when safety is at risk. We also support and enforce the ordinances of the city of Minneapolis and the laws of the state of Minnesota. And that includes such things as putting up tents, fires, blocking streets for extended periods of time not allowing for folks to get through. It is time to pivot to a moment of working together on the issues that we all care about to create one Minneapolis and move forward together. Mayor Hodges also tells us if protesters want to talk with her as they have in the past, her door is still open. Ashley, thank you for your reporting. We will continue to follow this story today and we'll have the very latest online and tonight on our newscast at 5 and 6.